joined by Adam Potter today on Seagulls TV after the side's four goal loss in their second practice match of the year. Uh, Adam, obviously not the ideal uh, result, but you must have got a lot of positives out of the match. Yeah, look at this time of the year, we're not too concerned about uh, the result at the end of the day. It's more about, uh, you know, yeah, our processes and what we're trying to achieve on a match day. We obviously had 27 players go uh, through the senior side again today, which is a positive. So, yeah, it's more about um, you know what we're doing at the ground run. So I'm well pleased with some of our uh, ball movement patterns, but probably our second quarter in particular was we lapsed a little bit, so that was disappointing. It's always good to get a look at some new players. So how did you feel some of the new boys went today, like in particular the younger ones, Sam Critchley and Josh Bench? Yeah, look, we played Josh Bench down back for the first time, and uh, you know he did some good things. There'd be some good learning from uh, the vision for him. Um, Sammy Critchley was good. Um, you know he needs to back himself in down there. Um, young Jake going up forward, I think he kicked a couple and showed a bit. And young Michael Gibbon showed that uh, he's also going to be a player in the future for us. So, yeah, we're pleased to be able to give those young guys an opportunity and blend them in with our senior guys. When you kicked four goals in the space of five minutes at one point in that third turn, that must have been a promising sign uh, for the season to come. Yeah, look, you know, that third quarter still aware of being, I think, you know, it was five goals apiece and, yeah, we did kick some uh, quick goals, but they probably got us in the centre bound. So, um, while we're pleased that we were able to put some scoreboard pressure on, at the same time they were able to transfer the ball pretty easily as well. So, you know, again, we'll have a good look at those stoppages and make sure we're giving the players the appropriate feedback. And just the final one, uh, will next week be, you know, used as a full dress rehearsal before round one? Yeah, look, um, we'll still, you know, play a couple of extra numbers, I reckon. Um, you know, around that 25 mark. But, yeah, it's, um, you know, a full dress rehearsal in terms of our our setups with our, with our coaching and the players and what we want them to achieve on the day. So definitely, um, you know, and then we've got the week off, the week up for round one. So we're definitely looking at uh, next week as the, the foot of the heading into round one. Thanks very much for joining us, Adam, and best of luck on the year. No worries, thanks.